Hi, it's Deanna from Futures Past, and today I'm going to uh, show you uh, one of my favorite paintings. It's contemporary, um, and I'll tell you the backstory um, about how I acquired it. So um, one night, several years ago, I was uh, scrolling through auctions on a website. It wasn't eBay, and uh, a bunch of Goodwills um, were auctioning off things that were donated to them, and I saw this painting. And uh, I loved it. I loved it. I love old structures, old architecture, um, old buildings. And I suddenly like took one look at this and I had to have it. And it was a seven day auction. And for seven days, I sweated it out waiting for this, you know, the final day, the day of reckoning, I call it. And uh, in the photo and descriptions, um, you know, description, uh, they did not say the name of the artist. They just said painting of building. And uh, so what I did was uh, I tried to find out who the artist was. So with their like lousy photo they had, they had one photo. Um, I blew it up on my computer and I was like really like mulling over who the signature could be. And finally it came to me and it looked like it said Gingerich. So I looked it up and it turned out it's none other than a very, very well-known artist by the name of Jim Gingerich. And from what I read, Jim Gingerich uh, hailed from Texas. A bunch of his paintings are found in museums, um, colleges all over the country. Uh, he's had many, many, many exhibitions. He's well known out in the Hamptons. And so he was a Texan that moved to New York in 1976. I think he lives in Bridgehampton. I think that's not far from the Hamptons. And uh, so I sweated it out. So the day came when it was like uh, ready to, uh, you know, uh, the auction was ready to end. And I hovered my finger over that button in the last few seconds of the auction. And it started out at $9.99. And I ended up winning this painting. I think the shipping was more money than this painting. And I got this painting, I think, for under $125 with the shipping. And I was a nervous, nervous wreck. Because, you know, I figured the employees at Goodwill do not know how to pack very well. And I was so afraid this painting was going to come torn, ripped, and damaged. But the day came, I opened up the box, and it came. It was as pristine as the day it was made. And uh, it came, I believe, <clears throat> all the way from some western state like Oregon or Washington State. It came from far away, and I live on Long Island. And I waited a good, like, six, seven days for it to come. And so uh, what I found out about Jim Gingerich is uh, his paintings are quite unique. Um, he paints a lot of genres, landscapes. He's a wonderful illustration artist. Uh, he does portraits. He also does uh, cowboys and like the uh, West, you know, like uh, paintings with like cowboys and uh, the West. Uh, he also does like mythological type of scenes. Um, he's just amazing. And what I love about this uh, painting is it shows a very old uh, Hamptons farmhouse. It has corabels on the, uh, going around the roof. It uh, has Gothic style windows. It has like old wooden uh, siding, a lovely little porch. Um, and what I, uh, what I find amazing about this artist is his brush strokes. As you can see this, Oh my goodness, thousands upon thousands upon thousands of brush strokes, as you can see with this old tree. Um, in the background, you see the uh, beach, which is the Hamptons. Um, but look at his use of color. Everything appears as if it's moving. Um, look at it. It looks as though this painting is alive and dancing before your, your eyes. Um, the colors, his use of shading. Um, is just truly spectacular. The sky, the clouds, everything has such a movement to it. It's like he's, uh, I mean, in a, in, in like a category of his own. I mean, absolutely amazing. So he took what was an old farmhouse and brought it alive. He made it appear as though it's alive. And you can see, look at this, even the grass with the fall leaves. The steps, the shading, I mean, absolutely amazing. It's almost as if ghosts or p 
peering down on you, looking out the window. And uh, he took the season of fall and just brought it alive for me. And that's my favorite season of all, autumn. And I just, I don't know why, I just love that tree. It's like getting ready, all, all the leaves are getting ready to fall off. The winter's coming. But then it has a, a hint of, of uh, you know, like still there's still warmth left in the air. You can see that with the ocean. Um, so uh, Jim Gingrich, um, he'll probably never see this uh, video and he'll probably never know how much I admire his work. Um, you know, he can never know how much I appreciate his art, but I hope one day he uh, truly, truly realizes how much he's touched my heart. Um, and uh, honestly, I could never afford one of his paintings. I, I've seen them for sale on the internet. And this one is going to be a treasure that I'm going to keep probably forever. I will probably never, ever, ever sell this painting. To me, it's a treasure, a treasure um, that has no value. It's just priceless. So uh, I was glad I was able to share this with you. Uh, thanks for watching. And Jim Gingrich, if you're out there watching this, thank you. Thank you for sharing your beauty with the world. Um, you have quite a talent. So once again, thanks for watching. If you like what you see, hit the thumbs up and subscribe.